well. It's been a good couple of months since the last time I did a video on this channel and quite a lot has gone on in my life since then. For those of you who are aware, uh, I did do a video that I uh, ended up taking down in the end, but uh, a friend of mine passed away. It was about two months ago. That uh, was uh, quite a trip. I feel in a pretty good place at the moment. I feel quite healthy and strong and there's a few things that I've been uh, addressing financially, looking at uh, money I could be saving, eating better, working out more, all the usual shit that we always have to do. But uh, at the moment I'm in a fairly good place. I do however have a lot of friends and people close to me who are still very much stuck in the ravages of alcoholism etc depression anxiety as I do myself but there's one thing I'm starting to come to terms with there was a quote by that Marcus Rayley bloke Marcus Aurelius something about you know you can't change whatever but you know your thoughts and that are yours you have power over your mind not outside events realize this and you will find strength oh how dramatic and uh... and essentially that's where I kind of find myself in life at the moment is basically trying to be the best version of me I can be and there's certainly a lot of improvements that need to be made that's for damn sure you can't change other people you really can't all you can do is hopefully lead by example and hope that people see that and maybe get the message themselves if you want to change the world, change yourself. How many quotes are you going to do today? Yeah, I've got no real plan for this video. I just thought I'd come out for a walk and uh, I just filmed something. I wanted to get a video up on this channel again. A lot of people have been paying attention to the three years sober video that I did. A lot of people seem to be getting a lot out of that. I'll definitely be returning to that subject at some point because I know how important it is for some people. I know that some people have been re-watching the video. I think there's something about somebody you don't know talking about things. I think the ego gets in the way so much when uh, when somebody we know tells us something we don't want to hear. Yeah, I did that already. You don't know me. And I'm just as bad for it. Basically what I'm trying to say is I think I am starting to see the value in these videos I have been doing. Because uh, even though I haven't posted anything in a while, the subscribers have been going up. And uh, the video count seems to be nicely moving in the right direction as well so people are paying attention to them what a beautiful place this is and also the comments that i've been getting have been really nice as well there's a lot of people who seem to be genuinely appreciative of them and uh getting something out of them so that's good so hopefully a lot of you will end up watching this video and hopefully this video will actually make some form of sense so what is the purpose of this video well things start with the self oneself and it's very easy to get into the quagmire it's very easy to get uh, limited in life and this little trip that i'm going on right now is kind of part of what inspired it i live in the county of gloucestershire shire 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 in the glorious country of englandhamshire and most of the videos i film are out here in the cotswold hills like a lot of you i'm sure i get overwhelmed by being around people all week and kind of my reset is to come out here into the countryside and get away from people for a while and just be alone with my thoughts and a camera in your face but again it's easy to get caught into the same rut the same routine now what does that have to do with this path i'm walking well i've walked around here for years and this is a path that i've never taken i quite often go the same route there are sometimes there are reasons for this timing you don't have time to explore you know what a, what if you go a certain way and then you don't you know you get lost or whatever there's always those excuses but this fine easter weekend has been a particularly glorious one the weather has been absolutely exceptional and i came out for a walk the other day felt pretty good on energy saw this path and thought you know what i'm going to give it a go see where it leads and it was absolutely glorious it was absolutely beautiful i found all these areas that i have seen from afar but have never gotten to before and it was just such a glorious walk and it just got me thinking about how in life we just get stuck in the same old rut, the same old routine. Now this isn't like a major adventure, but it was something different. It was good. It did make me feel good about myself. I went out and I did something different. I went a different path. I tried something new. I'm sure that this journey now will feel somewhat shorter because I know where I'm going. 
but there was something nice about that first journey, that first trip going around here. It was all new, it kind of, everything mattered. I was hyper aware of everything. I was looking at everything, I was remembering everything. What if I get lost this way? Go back that way. But it was a nice experience. I came away from it having found something new and something great and I'd done something a bit different and I know that I need to do more of that in life and uh, I think I'm going to go back to trying to do weekly reports on this channel about where I'm at. I've been trying too hard to come up with new ideas for things to do with this channel and in the end I do fuck all. So instead what I want to try and do is maybe just put out a weekly video about whatever see how I'm feeling, see what I'm doing. Hopefully it relates to you guys, what you're doing. I wanna try and do some different things. I do apologize, by the way, if I'm covered in a paste. I'm gonna protect that lily white skin. England, I'm shire skin. On my music channel, free to be who I be, I did a video for Record Store Day, which happened last weekend. And I did something a bit different for it. There's a bit of traveling around. There's a bit more variety in the video and I really enjoyed it. And I really enjoyed how the video came out and that felt good as well. I think that's a big thing in both the channels that I've been trying to do. I've been losing a lot of momentum and I've just been kind of getting bored really. And it can be difficult to do something new. We do things the same way because it's easy a lot of the time. We don't really have to think about it. That's why routine can be such a easy thing to get caught in. Routine can be good. Routine can be very good. You know, especially if you're trying to keep healthy and get your finances in order, which I fucking am. But it can also have the adverse effect where you just don't really learn anything new anymore and you don't do anything new and you don't grow. It's like when you exercise, if you do the same thing time and time again, you don't get anything out of it. Your body just adapts to it and you don't grow anymore. You don't, you don't get stronger, you don't get more flexible, you don't get more something. So I want to try and do a few different things, whether it be traveling a bit more or just trying different diet plans or workouts or different routines, something. I've got to try and do something new in life because, you know, it can get so boring. Life is a truly glorious and wonderful thing. It's something that, you know, the, the chances of any of us being here is miraculously low. It's pretty crazy when you think about it. And there are so many people living miserable existences. Some of them don't have much choice. But a lot of us have lives that could be so much better, but we wreck them through alcohol, through drugs, through overeating, through poor health, poor choices, poor thought patterns. So I do believe that depression can somewhat be combated by choosing how we think. I do believe that is somewhat possible. Not always. Don't get me wrong, depression gets his fucking claws into me on a more than regular basis, but uh, I think there are ways to combat it. And this isn't a bad start. Getting out, walking. Mmm, makes me feel good. Discovering something new. It's back to work tomorrow. And everything will go back to the same old routine. And that's uh, another thing that I want to take a look at at some point. And I'm definitely going to be doing videos on more on alcoholism. I know a lot of the people who have got interest in this channel have uh, come through that alcohol video that I did. So that's definitely something I'm going to be looking more at. In fact, maybe I'll do something in a moment. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll try and get two videos done today. Oh, wouldn't that be a wonderful thing? I don't know what I'm going to do next, but I do feel quite inspired to talk at the moment. So maybe I'll uh, film another video in a minute and uh, that will follow shortly. Who knows? But uh, it's high time I got this channel up and going again. I think it's an important thing to do. I'd like to thank everybody who has been paying attention to the channel. And there's a deer. A deer just crossed my path. Is there a metaphor for that? Does that mean anything? Now that I've got a bit more light to be able to get out and walk a bit and get inspired a bit more as well, hopefully I'll do some more videos for you guys. But I've talked way too much and I've now got to the point where I'm just talking absolute shies. So I'll catch you later. Mm -hmm.